Hello Jammers, welcome back Jammers. Thank you so much to all of our new subscribers. We're delighted um, that, you know, as I've mentioned, that we'd had dropped the ball the last maybe four months. Um, starting from the new year, we have decided that we're going to, or rather I'm going to be going off with a bang guys, keeping you updated with all of the content, everything that's happening right here in Ghana. So today, Jammers, um, I'm really looking forward to, to the day actually. It's going to be all about charity, all about community, and as I've mentioned, that's what we're all about here at Jam Fam to the Motherland. I shall be putting the details in the description regarding Glen Sam. Um, do go ahead and follow him on Instagram. If you are not already aware of him, please do go ahead and follow because I'm sure um, Africa, Ghana, the world and beyond will be seeing a lot more of him. He is a creative here in Ghana, um, a content provider. He's all about art, creativity, something a bit different. So that's what we're all about as well. And today he is actually doing Love on the Streets, which is all about supporting and providing food. And let's see what else. Um, you know, this is my first time coming along. Charity begins at home, guys. So keep watching, keep jamming. We are now at 500 subscribers. Really appreciate all of your support, guys. If everyone that watches our content just presses that subscribe button, we'll get to where we want to get to a lot quicker. Jammers, keep jamming. Come home to Ghana. Very important, come home to Ghana. If you don't want to relocate to Ghana, at least visit Africa and the continent. This is where we're all from and this is where it's all happening. So we're currently just at the National Theatre, which is just opposite Mobenpik um, Hotel, which is in Accra Central. So yeah, I've still got this um, English thing in me where I actually turn up at the time when someone says. <laughs> So Jammers, see you soon and Jammers! Okay Jammers, so here you go. As I've mentioned, we are just at the National Theatre. Um, go ahead and Google. I'm still learning as well, but I'm sure the name depicts what it actually is. National Theatre, that's the gift shop there. I've just bought a lovely um, a Ghanaian, or Ghana flag rather, um, pouch. Um, yeah, I tried to make, I wanted to buy all three of them, um, but they weren't really moving, so I've only bought one. That's the bag there, lots of lovely things there. Actually, I think I might just take you into the shop so you can see the types of items that you are able to buy. So here we go. He said, next time I come, he's gonna give me a discount. I said, why not now? But yeah, here we go, guys. Um, the fanny pack outside was 60 cities. And um, these gorgeous clutch bags in here are 40 cities. So I, I could have bought all three, but I just thought, no, it doesn't make sense. The price points make zero sense. That straw bag or weed bag is 30 cities. And the Ghana, fanny pack is 60 cities so I just thought I'm not doing it these lovely purses are 20 cities I mean even these gorgeous slippers um, it looks like they're made of some kind of um, cow fur or something like that is it cow yeah. oh there you go and look these are 50 cities so why would my pouch be 60 cities I do recommend guys that is one of the top tips to actually have one of these fanny packs um, because yeah they are worthwhile having here in the motherland so i'm back outside now jammers i haven't given up i've asked him to call um, the owner back to say that i'm still waiting out here i'd be more than happy to buy the other two at 40 cities as i think that's oh, 40 cities each that is i think that would be a fair price um, based on the other items that she has for sale in there. Um, and there we go, we've got the headquarters, it seems, for First National Bank, of who I do recommend here in Ghana. We've got a little plaque here, Values for Life. 
lovely. So this is the National Theatre um, and that's going to be it for now. I've met one lady there, Lena, who I am waiting with and um, yeah, jammers, we shall see you soon. Hashtag love on the streets with Glen Sam. Very much looking forward to it and you know, giving back to the community. Um, I will show you some items actually that Mia had bought. Mia's back in the UK as you know and um, last October she called me and said oh mummy there, there are all these items and they're practically half price should I buy them and I said absolutely Mia buy them and put them in the box that you're sending across because she's done a fabulous job at sending things over to us and I said you know you never know when the time might come when I can give it to someone and today is going to be the day Jamis so again just follow your mind in everything that you're doing and you can't go wrong hi jammers okay whilst i'm waiting i thought i would just do a quick what's in my bag um if you haven't already watched the top tips what's in my bag upload please do go ahead and watch that i'll probably put the link for it also in the description um that's the fanny pack that i've just bought my mind is still on those other two but it's just out of principality i'm just not going to buy them um this is my other fanny pack here that my mum got me it's a lovely leather one and more often than not, I'm wearing that if I'm going to be going on long walks. I've always got a fan. I've always got an insulated drink bottle for water. Very important. Deodorant, perfume, hand cream. And um, also, again, what's in my bag, we spoke about this insulated water bottle, which is absolutely fantastic. That keeps things frozen for quite a long time. I've got some coconut water in that. Um, and I've also got a um, portable charger, always very important to always bring that along. Again, go ahead and watch what's in my bag for things to have on a general day in Ghana. Um, I've also got, as I mentioned, we've always got paracetamol, antihistamine, that kind of thing I always bring with me. And um, these days I also bring a bit of sage. You just don't know when you need to cleanse your area. So that's what's in my bag today, guys. Go ahead and watch that video. Yeah, still waiting. <sighs> I will learn to not turn up on time. <laughs> just a quick one to show you um, the, some of the items I was speaking about earlier um, that Mia had picked up. And they were just these lovely little cups that were left over from Halloween. And um, that's a torch mini torch that lights up and makes a sound and lots of different um, hand sanitizers um, a couple of dresses there this white dress i've been thinking about it since um christmas just thinking oh i wonder who i'd give that to because um it was a dress that ava only worn once like years ago and it's a beautiful dress and this other black pinafore in there um, a lovely lady Semma. Um, gorgeous, gorgeous summer. She had actually given it to Ava from her daughter. And you know, I just thought, you know, I want to give that to someone as well. Um, so yeah, this is what we've got today, guys. So when, wherever you are, sometimes, you know, if your mind tells you something and you see something and you think, oh, well, should I buy that? Should I pick it up? Just take it and get it because it's for a specific time such. I'm, I'm just looking forward to seeing which little girl I may well give that beautiful white dress to and this pinafore um, that was actually given to um, Ava from Senna who is actually Turkish so during this time as well we've all seen what's gone on in Turkey and in Syria so today um, you know despite what's going on in the world she's actually going to be a blessing to someone as she has been to us um, over the years. So keep jamming guys, stay positive, keep praying, God is able and keep positive. It always works out in the end and things always happen as it's meant to. At the right time, you know, everything comes together as it should. Okay guys, that's the front of the National Theatre. Lena doesn't want to give us a guided tour, beautiful Lena. <laughs> but there you go, I'll do all the talking as per usual. We're still waiting and I'm starving, so we're gonna see if we can find, well, I'm not starving, I'd like to get something to eat. So, Accra Central right now, and the National Sports Stadium. Okay, Lena's just going to go and inquire. 
Um, the National Sports Stadium is just over there towards your right. And again, this is Accra Central. Um, and Vida Cafe is just opposite there, guys. Um, another tip is that Vida Cafe, they have several locations and you get free Wi-Fi there. So that often is one of the backup plans that if we have light off, which fingers crossed hasn't been for some time, we can always just go to Vida Cafe. You know, their food is actually consistently very good. Um, whilst we do have Wi-Fi at home for downloads, Oh, there's a shop there okay perfect for downloads um we do take the children there to download all of their movies or any games etc so that's another tip there oh i can smell food there you go jammers as i say you know i mean look at that beautiful artwork over there let me just quickly just zoom over here just quickly come home to ghana i mean honestly well i just think you attract what you think and you attract who you are. So I've only just attracted positive people, nice people. She's actually got a daughter who's 16 and will be 17 in um, next year, well this year, just like Mia will be. So I'm quite looking forward to speaking to her further. Well, here you go. Here's um, Traffic Restaurant, Ghanaian, Continental and Chinese. So I'm just gonna grab something quickly, just something small because, um, going to be out in the heat haven't actually eaten so let's see what they've got in there oh yeah it smells lovely and it's beautiful in here i mean check this out guys this is africa this is ghana um ladies over here pounding the fufu um so yeah i want to make sure she might not want to be video so i'm just going to show you these lovely pots no i'm not videoing don't mind <laughs> I just got side eye, um, but yeah, I'm just gonna get some cheddar. Jammers, there you go. Um, I couldn't persuade Lena, but I think I think you should at least get a plate and share it with me because I'm definitely not gonna eat all of that. But look, that's my quick meal. I said something small, and that's what I've got. Yeah. Okay, jammers. Definitely, definitely, definitely. I can a hundred percent recommend this place it was a quick pit stop and now i'm ready for the rest of the day <laughs> i'm not getting you lena I'm not well, ready. <laughs> lena said she's a ghanaian so <laughs> we can go but apparently glen sam has now arrived but i definitely recommend traffic it was good just what i needed off we go for the rest of the day jammers oh again jammers come home to ghana as i say please do subscribe and as i've mentioned you know everyone is friendly welcoming i mean i've known lena all of <laughs> i'm just enjoying my chicken <laughs> all of um what 20 minutes and we've sat and had lunch a lovely lunch um and so we're off for the rest of the day keep jamming guys please click that subscribe button Lots more to come from Jam Fam to the motherland. Amen. Okay, Jam, so I'm going to get involved. So there's going to be less um, footage for now. Just getting all the bags all prepped and sorted. Love on the streets. Love on the streets of. Accra Ghana, come home to Ghana guys, sharing is caring and so yeah I've got to get involved so see you soon. Mama di mama. Jammers, jammers, jam fam to the motherland. <laughs> jammers there you go. We all come together, every little helps jammers. So we've just bagged everything up and we're just about to go off shortly but every little helps in being able to help our family jammers come home to ghana every little helps honestly every small contribution can make a difference there you 
Victor Javis. Yes, Leda. This morning I thought, yeah, I'm going to bring these to the office. Well, you are today, Leda. You are today. And there you go. You know, everything happens for a I'm reason. Coming. Everything for the right time, Jamis. So there are those items that I brought and yeah, looking forward to seeing who's going to get those jammers. Honestly, come home to Ghana. Come home to Ghana, Jamis. That's all I can say is literally come home to Ghana. There's Lena rocking those glasses, you know? Suits her as well. And there you go, Jamis. Obviously, that's a school. That must be something happening at the National Theatre today. Um, so, yeah. Google the National Theatre. Maybe there's some kind of spoken word or something that will be happening there. But I'm probably going to get going um, once we get into giving out and sharing amongst our brothers and sisters. I'll finish the video up so it may well end abruptly, Jamis. Obviously, I need to make sure that I'm, you know, focusing on what I've come here to do. So do keep jamming, do keep subscribing, jammers. And as I said, do go and check out Len Sam's um, Instagram page. Check out Jam Fam for the Motherland's Instagram page. And we can all do something, jammers. We. <laughs> I'm learning from her. She's actually videoing. You would think she's taking a photo, but she's actually, um, she's actually videoing someone else. So yeah, come home to Ghana. There you go, Jammers. That's Glen Sam over there. This is his initiative. They all come in together, Jamis. So hi, what's up? My name is Glen Sam. I'm a visual storytelling working artist. So uh, this is what I normally do uh, every second week of February, right? Me and my friends, we hit the street to feed our brothers and sisters. So uh, that's what I do. So you see me again. See him again. There you go, Mia. The things that you have bought, Mia. Look at that. God is good. It's going to go out for the children. Children, I love it, are getting your toys or the hand sanitizer and the cups. It's being given out. God is good. And I'm actually just trying to see if there's like a a young child oh there she is she's right there the girl that i'm gonna give ava's dress to she i can see exactly who i want to give the dress to i mean it's the little things you know it's the absolute little things and um yeah i want to can I give your daughter this dress? You can take beautiful. Do you want to take the dress? Yeah, yeah there you yeah, go. Yeah, yeah, man. Hold the dress, please. I can't hold yeah, in the video. You oh, can, no. can you put, give it to her? Is that okay? Oh. Don't worry. I, if you, you didn't get food, you want clothes as well. Don't worry. You, I'm gonna give her some money. But yeah, you've got to be grateful as well, haven't you? Maybe not as well as I thought, but there you go. I'm gonna give you some money. I think that's what they wanted to see. No, but that's the thing, I'm sorry. I mean, she wasn't... Yeah, but you weren't very appreciative. So the other lady has got the dress for her child and the money. But I can't, I can't do that, unfortunately. You know, in life, you've got to be grateful. And then, you know, things happen. I have to follow my heart and give things with a good energy. And then... Um, and that's the oh no 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 it was it was the energy i'm so lucky i've got someone negotiating for me there you go i told you you attract who you are and what you are 
There you go, two bags for me. Do you see what I mean, actually, Jamis? The, I wanted the two other bags, and um, they were 60 cities, weren't they? Yeah. So I'm interested to see what the Lord is going to get for me. I just naturally attracted Roxy along the walk here, and I don't know where everyone else is, but yeah, we've, walked and we've had a really good informative talk. I think some time will happen when we'll actually get the opportunity to sit down and have opinions as to why everyone is relocating to Ghana. I mean, he was really knowledgeable. And yeah. But anyway, Jamis, back to the matter. He's negotiating these two bags for me. I won't be surprised if I get the two of them for um, 60 cities, bearing in mind I was going to buy two other ones for 60 cities each because that's how the law works. <laughs> What's my price? What's my price? Oh, what about 60 for two? Like if your man can't mention price right there, go around now. That's my last, last, last. 60 for two and that's it. Either way, Jamis, I'm going to buy it. It is what it is. But there you go. I just want you to see. Look, and he's only got the two kinds of similar bags that I was looking at. Not the bum bags. I think I was calling them fanny packs, showing my age. But there you go. Yeah, I'm going to buy those two bags. Come home to Ghana, Jamis. 80? No, 70 most, if that's the case. Oh, thank you very much. Fandango, I'm coming. Ghana, Ghana, Ghana. Roxy, say something inspirational for my followers on. What's up, guys? So I met someone wonderful today. <laughs> yeah, that's my kind of language, the alcohol. No, it's not for the alcohol, it's for the fruit juice, for the children. Let me do it in there. Yeah, that is a lovely photo. Uh -oh. I'm home to Ghana. Okay, Jammers, so I'm just going to round up this video here now, Jammers. Okay, you can see that every little helps, Jammers. Please do go ahead and follow Glen Sam. Um, if there's anyone that you can think of that can potentially help with donations, because obviously, as he mentioned, he does it, you know, and maybe he could do it more often if the finances were there. There's always someone that we can help within our community, our brothers and sisters, Jammers. Please do continue to subscribe, Jamis. Um, this is something that is quite, you know, close to my heart as well. I've always said that I wanted to do something to do with charity. I do want to actually find an orphanage um, within Ghana. And I know at the right time that will happen. And I know with my skills, <laughs> my talkative skills, I'll be able to reach out to specific companies and see whether or not they will be also able to help us guys. Um, so yeah, what more can I say apart from much love, keep jamming, keep subscribing, jammers, come home to Ghana and if anyone does come to Ghana, please do feel free to reach out to me, connect. If there's anyone that, you know, works with any um, charity organisations, again, please feel free to reach out because I've got lots of plans in mind and it's going to take your help. It's going to take your support to get there. So please do click that subscribe button, Jammers. Lots of love. Stay blessed. See you soon. Love on the streets of Ghana, Jammers. Love on the streets of Ghana.